So today is a new day. So I'm gonna try to be a little more excited here. So good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. Yes, it's me, April Love, here in Boston, wishing you a blessed Friday. Truly hope you're finding reasons to smile, to laugh, to enjoy life, to appreciate everything and everyone around you. And today is Friday. It is fantastic Friday. And although I've been kind of down this week, you got to... Give me some props, and the highlight would be that I actually still vlogged all week. Whether they were good vlogs or not, I got them out, and I'm happy. All my Christmas shopping is done, although I feel like I should get something for my cats, and I just don't know what to get them. They're so picky. Anyway, as you see, I'm trying to keep my energy up today, stay positive, Today's a new day. Today is a blessed day. Today, if you're Muslim, is the prayer day, you know, the day that you go to church or to the mosque and, you know, you listen to the sermon. I didn't go today. I know that just got a lot darker. And who's here? Hi, Smokey. Shorty. He's excited because he thinks I'm going to open the window, but I'm not. I love you, buddy. Anyway, about to go food shopping with my mother. I know I normally don't record, but maybe I'll get a few interesting clips here and there. So in the meantime, is it blurry? I can't tell. <laughs> anyway. Well, I'm waiting for my mother to come down and let my car warm up. I figured I'd talk for a minute. I know I talk a lot. Um, and I know my, like I said, I know my energy's been kind of out of it this week. I put up videos, but I didn't even really promote them. I didn't, you know, let people know they were up. The few of you that actually watch my vlogs, you know, you obviously have your notifications on um, to know that I posted something. Um, but what's actually been helping me to get back to the, my good old positive self, um, and just wanting to be more happy and more, you know, optimistic and just in a better mood and emotionally just feeling good, um, what is... A mixture between listening to more of Abraham Hicks um, and about the law of attraction and um, getting back into my prayers and meditation. Um, the way I meditate is in the shower, um, the water, you know, you know, they talk about that um, sensory deprivation thing well I do something kind of sort of like that I mean I don't shut the lights off or anything like that but <clears throat> I do lie down let the water fill up around me and just <clears throat> you know calm myself and <clears throat> this past week I've been trying to get back into my five daily prayers you know, I still miss a couple, but I am making more of an effort to to pray. Because in essence, taking those, you know, five, ten minutes to pray is also... I'm going to try to adjust this. I don't know what I'm doing it. Right? Oh, wrong. I don't know. Let's see. That looks a little bit better. <laughs> All right, so... Back to what I was saying. The prayer, you know, prayers in general are in essence a form of meditation as well. When you stop and think about it. Maybe you're not a religious person and it doesn't matter what religion you're a part of. When you pray, it's meant for you to connect to God, but it's also a way for you to clear your mind, put all your problems to, aside, to the side for a moment, 
and you know focus and center yourself you know and you can decide in the in those moments that to look at what you have that you you feel blessed about what um you want in your life and believing that it can happen you know whether you believe the universe is going to help you get it whether you believe through hard work you're going to get it or through the power of prayer and god you know and for me it's a combination of it all you know i believe in meditation i believe in the law of attraction and i believe the, in the power of prayer in god so you know, because for me, I, like I said, I believe it all works hand in hand. Um, and with that, I'm going to just sit here and relax. Listen to little Abraham Hicks now while I wait for my mommy to come out. So, see you in a bit. I don't know, do you want, should, should I, should I? No, I'll give you a view and then I'll cut it out. Ready? Let's see. Let's bring the brightness down. Nope, we're gonna bring it down a little bit. And let's focus on that tree, shall we? Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Alright, so it is like almost 2 a.m. right now, and I apologize if I don't have something more interesting. I know that I say this all the time, because um, literally all I did today was go food shopping with my mother and came home. I did go out to get pizza with my brother, but, you know, all we did was have very minimal conversation because he's not someone that talks a lot. And other than that, I just played video games and watched a couple movies with my mother um, while racking my brain on how I can do something entertaining or, you know, a little more interesting, you know, for today's vlog. Um, but I have to admit, I was in better spirits today. Um, and I'm going to continue to work on that. To, um, today, Saturday, is another day. It's going to be a great day. It's going to be amazing, a blessed day. And, um, yeah, I'm going to relax and go to bed with that intention and hopefully wake up with that intention. Um, and until then, if you did get anything from this vlog, give it a thumbs up. Tell me what you did get from this vlog. Um, if you haven't already, subscribe. Um, and if you haven't forgot, if you've forgotten, I'm still trying to raise money for Zoomix and for music education. So if you head over to A Love Productions, the link is down below. 
specifically for the music collection. Any of those designs, any of the shirts in that collection, um, the profits are going to Zoomix, at least for this month, in music education. I may keep that collection for music education, and if I actually start making money, the more money I make on that collection, maybe every other month, or if I can sell a hundred shirts, you know, every hundred shirts I sell, 50% of those profits will go to a particular organization, or maybe to public schools for music education, or arts, or something. To the, I haven't figured it all out, but you know, I may keep that collection specifically for that. So, um, anyway, I'm going to end it. Again, I thank you for watching. And if it motivated you, if it did anything for you, if it gave you something joyful or, you know, just happy to see me a little more uplifted, you know, let me know and give me the thumbs up. And until a couple hours from now, <laughs> um, until the next vlog, like, love, share, and inspire. And don't forget, love is everything. Much love.